Hello and welcome to, well, <clears throat> how can I otherwise describe it, but welcome to Warriors Archie Ultimate. And I've got a weird setup set up here. Um, despite I'm still doing the reviews and the previews, I'm also going to throw in doing these playthroughs. And I'm basically going to do one, one level per episode per character. So I divide it out. For quite some time, and hopefully I manage to get through all the characters before the end of levels, because of course me and you will probably be getting quite bored by them. Anyway, we're going to start today, uh, today's episode, or new idea for an episode, with Guo Hai, wearing his really stupid looking hoodie, frankly. Anyway, um, let's... Not dive, well, let's dive in and get on with it. Basically, we're going to start off obviously with number one and work our way on from there. So, we're actually going to go before the game starts. I think it, no, we'll go easiest because low level character equals, yeah. Anyway, yeah, yeah, whatever. No one cares about blah blah blah. Do all that. Dun, dun, dun. I love this music. I don't care how many times I have to say it, I just love it. It's amazing music. And then it has to go ruin it with the bleeding voiceovers being in Japanese and Chinese. Why do they have to do that? We. Yeah, you may be wondering how a character has a machine gun when he's a character from the main Dynasty Warriors games. I'm just frankly not going to question it. Because it's still cool and also not entirely a gun, it's actually more of an inject a giant injection, or in other words, a night nurse. <laughs> oh dear. One of those games. I will probably have released the preview for this game for the Christmas reviews, so hope you're enjoying your Christmases and all that. Um yeah. I'll be enjoying Christmases, really. <laughs> I just, well, I'm just going to quickly comment on how, what the reason why I chose Grow High to start these off is, Grow High is one of my favourite characters from Jin, the new group that features in. Um, Dynasty Warriors, um, but it's also some kind of a seed of Wei, which is kind of strange, really, because frankly, Wei was the one that was winning, and now it's not. So, who the heck knows? I'm not gonna ask. I just love playing as Guo Hai. Um, one thing you can notice about this is that most Dynasty Warriors usually have some kind of X attack. I'm trying to work what mine out wine is, but I can't actually remember. Which one is it? Is it this one? No. Hang on a second. I'm going to cheat and find out. Get the combo list. Oh, it's double two. Oh, right now I get it. Mm, the simple one after all. Square. I. No, I didn't. Yeah, machine gun. <laughs> I do find that funny. I just find that incredibly hilarious how they decided they could fool us into thinking that they had some kind of machine gun. He had a giant nunchuck, maybe, but I don't think he had a giant machine gun. A crossbow, maybe? I don't know. I really didn't pay that much attention to Chinese history. Or I wish there was Chinese history in some British schools because some of this stuff is cool. Ah. <sighs> Yes. FYI, I am, yeah. 
It was either this, the machine gun, or the machine gun. I decided to go for the funniest thing I could find, and it was the night nurse. For God's sake. Yeah. Um, also, yeah, the thing is with Guohai is that he's actually one of the characters who I most sympathise with. Because th those that know me know that I have an annoying pain in the ass condition that I have to live with for the rest of my life. I'm not going to go into detail as what that is. It's not much of a pain in the ass because I can deal with it. I know people with much worse. Um, but... Oh, this is annoying. Go away. I don't care. You, you're horrible. No. No, 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 no. Fuck off. Um, his grow high has an illness, major illness, that basically... This, the, almost disables him as a, a major char a good character but at the same time it makes him a really good character because you can sympathize with him because he's constant he is honestly always dying i mean look at the image in the corner i mean i'll probably point it out to you in the video but the fact of the matter is is that he's coughing in his profile image they could have gone for anything for that one but no they decided to push the fact that this guy's ill also half his moves signify that um, because when he does his X attack, which I'll show you in a minute, one, two, three, so he does that, he's fine, does that, and then he goes again, and then you see him do this, falls to the ground because he f almost, his illness takes a nasty turn towards him, which as I said, it makes him more relatable, which I kind of like, also his weapon is kick ass, so you know. Um, yes. Uh, when you saw that loading screen, is that's not because the game needs to load every five seconds like a really bad PS1 game. No, this game is terrible because its cutscenes do not work. I'll probably show you one next episode, but frankly I'm just going to save time and leave that to my review rather than my um playthroughs that I'm... It's not even a let's play really, it's just me just playing the characters, having a fun time, explaining shit. Ex I'll, most likely I'll be playing my favourite characters rather than just every single character, and by far there are a few favourite characters of mine. Um, and yes, some are a bit risky compared to the usual stuff you find on these manga games. I, I don't use manga games, anime games, either way I don't care. But, I, I don't watch anime, but some of the stuff in this game is really risky for, like, you know, what audience? I don't even know, because I don't even have the box anymore, because it's not a box game. Um, I think it's a 12, probably, roundabouts. And, yeah, one of the skins you can buy as a DLC makes one of the more beautiful characters in the game pretty much like uh, Super Saiyan mode, but naked. Much like this character is in his Super Saiyan mode, apparently. This is, yeah, this is apparently what they say is his Super Saiyan. Um, I don't believe it, because he looks like he's a... He looks like he's got a dumpling on his head. And yes, the dumplings are, like, major things in this game, because they're your health buffs. So, you know, it's kind of bloody weird having one on your head. Okay, albeit it's a bit weird at having them as bombs. Yes, those glowing orange things, they're dumpling bombs. They are... Blatant bombs. And then there's a the naked woman. <laughs> Deary me. Naked woman. Get the mop head. Jesus Christ. Miss. Da 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 da. Boom. And then. Whee! All the bullets. Yep. That reminds me. What kind of character is this guy? Oh, it's technique. Well, that explains it. It doesn't explain it. He's so easy to play, and if it's a technique character, it makes him difficult to play. How the hell? Why am I? Oh, hang on, I just realised something. I'm now just dominant strategying it up in this house. Right, back to normal attacks before I keep on doing the X attack constantly. One, two, three. There we go. No. It's just 
Guo Hai seems to me like a more likable character because of course you feel sorry for him and he's trying to actually do his best on the battlefield. Yes, you're playing him, and yes, it's a mash him up. Yes, it's a mass killing mash him up, but it doesn't really matter because for me, all the characters manage to somehow speak to you in a way. It's just it is kind of weird for a mash him up, but they actually managed to develop storyline throughout a mash him up. So you know, yeah, this is not this is not what I call a bash him up where you just just spam square, spam square, spam square, spam square. No, this is a mash him up where basically you've got thousands and thousands of soldiers to go against and you've got nice little combos to work through to keep the game interesting i mean i could i didn't even know this the other day but i could press the back button and i can summon the other two people in the group but then they'll go off on their own and do whatever the hell they want to and someone died you get talking too much if you talk too much your allies will die and then of course i can i can call them back because they're getting too far away from me and i don't like being alone also, I prefer to be having them near, well, pretty much at me, because the simple fact is, is that if I get hit, that happens. Because then, they will save me from death. Stop doing that, Rich. Stop doing that, Nopet. Jeez. I'm getting sick and tired of this now. Come on. There we go. No! Stop. It may be dominant strategy, but it doesn't matter. Stop pressing it two times. One, two, three. There we go. That's much better. <sighs> I don't know. I've not a clue. This game is one of those games that literally, as soon as you learn the dominant strategy, you just keep on using it. So it's really hard to get away from some of the exit attacks you can get on here. So, for example, double square triangle with this character equals minigun. No problem with it, of course, but I'm trying to mix it up almost. I'm trying to show you a bit more to the character. And yes, you may notice that there's a couple of bright glowing flashy lights at the bottom of the screen, which I'm almost tempted to use in a bit, but I don't want to use in a bit. I want to use it on the main bad guy, but you know. Tempted. Flashy lights. We. I just love that. I'm sorry, I don't care. It's fun as hell they do. But boring as heck when you keep doing it. That, okay, I'm gonna just go into bit review mode here and say that that's why I like Warriors Orochi and all the Dynasty Warriors Koei games. Koei Warriors games, there you go, that's the right one. All the Koei Warriors games. It's because they have instant repellability. You want to complete all the characters, blah blah blah. You want to discover which one's your favourites. How you know I mean <sighs> Guo Hai is one of my favourite characters, full stop. So it's Kanbei Kuroda, Nobunaga, Lu Bu, uh Orochi X. And yes, some of these may be sounding like the most powerless bad guys in the game, but I'm sorry, but they are really good fun to play. Sometimes the bad guys are the fun guys to play, and to be frankly honest, I choose to sit over the Jedi any day. Because that's how I am. Yeah, you heard right. I, cho I choose Sith any day. At least let you have relationships. <laughs> Deary me, I made one of those. God, I'm sad. And young me. I'm always a young. You sad muppet. Yeah, no. Ignore me. No, I'm just being a twit. As always. Right, now I'm going to do what in this game is called a true travel attack, which really doesn't make any difference no matter what character you do, it's always the same thing. So you press the buttons, they go to manga mode, anime mode, whichever. And then you run around, lighting everyone up in blue, making everyone really pretty, like Christmas lights. Do all of this, and then you let go, and then you watch them pull a pose. One, two, three, and pull a pose. And then, Power Ranger, they're dead. Well done. You done good. Okay, it's fun. <laughs> fun game. And that's one thing I do have to say right now, is the music in this game is amazing. It's atmospheric, it's fun. And some of it is damn right inspiring. 
Welcome Back is one of the good ones. It's the, the ones where you can almost picture yourself going welcome back to the characters. Or them going welcome back to you. Doesn't matter. Either way, you can imagine yourself doing it. And then, of course, it gets you in the killing mood. And then, of course, you get to kill about over 1,300 enemies in two seconds. I'm a nice person. <laughs> Such a nice person that, you know, I can kill over a thousand enemies and not worry about it. Come on, let's do this, you and me, buddy. And that was just basic attacks. Right, now I'm going to do the special move for this character, because why the heck not? It's the main bad guy, I can do it. Let's do this. I got him. And he's so screwed. And I can do it again, and I've fainted. Great. I'm doing it again because it's fun. <laughs> oh no, what are you going to do? You're dead. <laughs> and I die. Yay. <laughs> wow. I love this character. <laughs> anyway. Before this, well, yeah. I'm just going to say, Grow High, fun to play. Love playing him. This is episode one.